Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to this Total War Warhammer Rise of the Tomb Kings. Let's play. It's not that much replenishment. Canoptic jars. I want canoptic jars. I like canoptic jars. I like having lots of canoptic jars. Our Necrotech's got a rank up. Get it. Restore so it can heal my tomb scorpion. The realm of souls feels with my foes. Brilliant. Oh, achievement unlocked organ collector. I want the spearmen. I want those carrion. Now just those two. Your king, slaves. That'll have to do for now. We're gonna get attacked by this guy again, suiciding on over. Which is a pain. Because he's gonna have Setra back again, a bit perfect timing. Right, as for here is Zandri. Oh. Mm. Pyramid of King. Corruptic mm. charge generated. Mm. Wind of magic powers. There's. Mm. Trade. Mm. Additional resources. Mm. It appears we have this here. Oh. So we're getting the pottery and we're going to get that. Can't build a defensive building though, but it's quite in the middle, so unless sand comes at me specifically from there, it'll be well defended. Right. You can see here, I would like to leave, have a peace treaty with these guys now. So I think they'll be more willing to accept now that I just destroyed their army. Well, that's why I'm a, a lot stronger than you, eh? Eh, eh, eh? Yeah. Right, we're gonna keep on going there then. Money, 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 how am I gonna make more money? Right, let's then turn and we'll keep recruiting there. These guys are gonna head on over soon. <gasps> yes, he's using global recruitment to recruit, that's gonna slow him down a bit. And that sand veil, tomb swarm. Two more turns of that damn OP ability that's meant to be defensive. It's when you're in your own territory you're meant to get that, but he's not. They're getting it in my territory. And even his allies getting it in my territory. It's like, come on. Anyone should be getting it. It's me. Victory in undeath. There, this is it here. I can perform that right too. 20 turns, no effects for 5 turns, 20 turns, and nah, I won't get it when I'm attacking, look. Someone's trying to, uh, yeah, the gun invokes to make a sandstorm and blast across the dunes, the rid to both living and dead. Or is wrong? To you will be hit by sandstorms causing attrition. Army ability, all armies. Oh, so it's not, that part is not defensive, that's just all armies. Okay, I can see this because I thought it was just your regions. Okay, so it makes sense that they've got it all. And I bet you those people last parts go and uh, rah, 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 rah. Yeah. Shouldn't have. It is all armies, not just defensive armies. It's a def defensive ability. Uh, Hanks, so that's why I just assumed that. I never actually came in here and read it. Wait a minute. Tombstorm. Isn't that the one they're using? All armies again. It's, they've used both. Or did they just use this? construction. Yeah, so two can play that game. I can get that for ten turns. Oh, I've got to build a citadel first. Is that the tier three one? Mausoleum. Wait a minute. They shouldn't be able to cast that. Oh wait, no, citadel is that a Building browser. There it 
is there? It's just damn cheating AI. That's a tier four building that require that that requires. And they definitely don't have a tier four settlement. All they've got left is Camry. So how have they casted that ability? Am I am I herpa McDurpin here? Am I seeing something wrong? The reason I can't cast it is because I don't. It was the Tomb Swarm one. That's the blue one. Yeah, that's the crap one. Sandfail. I don't know how I got that in the last battle. Well, that's the one that causes lots of damage. It's an AOE. Weekly single combatant. Yeah, that's the one that's been pissing me off. And it's all armies as well, not just defensively. How the hell did I get that? Who knows? It didn't, it's not as though it helped me anyway. Construction time, growth. But yeah. It's impossible that Camry cast that, because I've not attacked Camry, no one else has attacked Camry to take it from a 4 down to a 3. So, again, cheating AI. Alright, anyway, what's this for? Thanks for letting me know, I would love to get that up. Right, let's end turn. As soon as I get... Damn, AI's been gimmicky again with the one guy in the settlement. So we're going to have to retreat. Then what are they going to do? They're going to... They're, they're both... They're going to... They're going to try and go for it. So we're going to have to fight this battle now. Oh. Damn pain in the backside. But no Cetra this time. Their lords are relatively weak and squishy, so I've got that to look forward to. And we're back. The one guy besieging's all over there on his lonesome. He's standing right there. I can tell you from when my troops were positioned over here. Don't believe me? Look, bam! He should appear. There he is. He's appearing right now. And their reinforcements are somehow coming from inside the settlement. So uh, let's start the battle. There's their lord. Get a spirit leech on him right away. There we go. We got them surrounded. They're chariots too, so they ain't doing a gonna be doing much all surrounded archers focus on the chariots first they go in guard mode chariots first all their lord just went flying suppose necrotech get right in there too oh that is not fair did they just do it? I think they did no, their damn cheating ability! Yes, I move. Their damn cheating ability! Ready. Where's that lord of theirs gone? There is there. Oh, there's their catapult. It's not going to be able to do much. Just in case it does get to fire from there. It does get to fire from there. Scorpion, push through on into it. Scorpion, go, go, go. Damn cheating AI! Where's the other lord? There's no sign of him yet. I was hoping to deal with all this first, but their ability. Damn ability was a pain. But they're starting to crumble away now. Where's that lord? There's their spirit leech on him again. Into that! Alright, just go for the lord. Archers, you just go for the catapult then. Right, he's miles away. He's not going to get here in time. Right, the catapult's being neutered.
The leader's nearly away. Oh, actually, no, he's not. He's still got quite a lot of health. The catapult's nearly away. They got their damn OP ability again. Damn OP ability! They're not even meant to have it. The AI cheated to get it. Right, I survived a second load of it. Right, archers. Archers all turn around and go after this guy. He does have a good missile block chance, unfortunately. What, again? They got to use it a third time? Oh, this is just not fair. Oh, and they got the Ushabiti. Though luckily they're nearly dead, somehow, already. But yes, First Lord's dead, they're crumbling. They're crumbling. We're gonna lose all of our uh, Tomb Guard, though. GG, cheated AI, GG. My elite units are all gone. But at least I should look at it this way. I'm getting battle every second turn. Where we're leveling up Arcan constant. We're going to be leveling up Arcan a lot. And at least their damn OP cheating ability is gone and dusted now. So it cannot keep ruining my armies. Damn cheating AI. And we're back again. 8% replenishment is actually starting to look quite attractive. It's not that much money. It's only a hundred. Yeah, we'll go for the replenishment this time. Wait a minute, he survived? Hmm. Oh, he's getting to escape. How did he survive? Did the chariots actually manage to retreat off the fields? Oh, that's just going to speed up his return. Right, so he's on a second. And we're back. Regiment of Renown unlocked. Oh, beautiful. I could really use an elite archer unit. Boom, recruit. Let's take a look at the difference. Good range, armor sundering. Armor sundering. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, they're going to be a godsend when I face off against the dwarves. They got 20 extra armor, 10 more leadership. Double the melee attack, so that'll probably be mainly thanks to the chevrons. Uh, 10 extra melee defense, that'll be mainly thanks to the chevrons. And oh, 160 range. Nice. Very nice. Yes, anyway. Arkan has a rank up. Definitely want less sun scorched bones. Necrotect has a rank up. Oh, I've got restore. I didn't use it in that last battle. I didn't click. Constant around him. Constant around him. So just having him close will make that stronger. For now, I think we'll go for the indomitable will. There is no other king. Screw them for now. Tomb guard. Two turns to recruit. Then them. Then the girls. My that means he's one unit short. Which we'll take. The unit of spearmen from this guy. And we'll great to recruit with him. So, and he's not coming over this turn. <sighs> okay. He's mustering here. 
So you know what I'm actually going to do? He doesn't have that many units. Should we just go in for it? Should we just go in for it? You know, I'm going to make a quick save because this might be a huge mistake. But I want the walls to protect, to defend here. We don't have a... We don't have one of them yet either though. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Right, here we are folk. I'm clumping over here. I want to minimise the number of towers that can fire at me. I've even just abandoned the battering ram because it's two in the middle. Let's uh, start the battle. Boom, boom, boom. Take a wall, take a wall, take a wall. Cavalry, get right over here. You, climb that wall. Yous, get over here. Archers, get over here. Chariots, get over here. I think that's everyone are running. Just gonna tell everyone to climb the walls right away. Just climb those walls. Sooner I stop these towers of fire in the better. As soon as I take those gates too, the hexen rafes are gonna be beautiful once I've taken those gates. The ghouls are gonna be brilliant on the Oh no, the uh, chariots are getting in its road. The chariots, no! That ability! I don't know if this AI is cheating, it just probably is, because I can't see all its settlements. But it looks like my towers are actually going to get to the walls, lovely. Which is the main thing stopping me from just curb stomping them, so lovely. They're not even using that tower, it's brilliant. My lord's starting to climb. I've got ghouls to get onto the walls. The Nekahara warriors are on their way. To the walls! Why is this tower glitching? Go! What's stopping it? Whatever you are, you're in the road. What's... Out of its way! Let it go! There we go, it's going to stop glitching now. Oh, this one's doing the same. Is it the Hexen Wraiths? There we go, it's moving. Oh, and my archers are destroying their horsemen. Lovely. We're climbing the walls. The walls will be mine. It's a glorious siege. It's going gloriously well. Follow your brethren on up. Who's just that, actually? Ah, man. Look at their archers there, which are a pain. Then the walls will be mine and they'll be undamaged. Happy days. Why is this unit? Why are they? Why are they running? Thinking of these are perfectly fine. Stop derping. These are on the walls. Things are going well. You outnumber the enemy. Yeah, exactly. Rally. The heart of the city is within sight, my lord. Press forward. And their damn OP ability again. Bring my archers over to start firing upon their archers and the chariot archers because that's the main problem right now now I need to push on and take the gate they're crumbling they're gonna go they're, they're engaging in melee oh happy days for me Right, I just need to take that gate and then my Hexen Wraiths are going to go have a field trip. Do 
Let's get some units down now. They do have uh, their Shabbaty and this guy in reserve. Apart from that, they've only got like three units left. There he's getting some of his replenishment. I think that's his first load of replenishment. I don't think he's got enough men to get their Shabbaty. Need to stay out of this tower's fire arc. Oh, that's plenty. It's bigger than I thought. Can't summon the Shabbaty onto the walls, can I? Can the Shabbaty go on the walls? I don't think they can. I think they're too big. But they're gonna fall fast now that they, they their warriors hell do it quite well. But they're gonna crumble now. This is going about... Uh, it's going better than I expected, actually. Right, come on, push on over. Take the other side of the wall. It shows the Shabti... Oh, I thought that was a bow he's got there, but it's a sword, now that I look at it closely. Because I thought that was the other side of the bow there. I thought it was curving around like that, and then I was like, wait a minute. That's not, it's one of those Kopesh or whatever they're called. Still climbing the walls. Come on, I want that gate! He's a crumbling. The unit's been wiped out, it was just a swordsman unit, so... Not a big deal. Come on! Come on. Wait a minute, this tower's counted as theirs? How? Now my chariots have been nuked by this tower, I didn't even notice. How the fudge did they reclaim that tower? It should be both of us. We both got units in there. Uh, not fair. Lost a whole unit of chariots nearly thanks to it. Attack the living! Attack the living! But it's now main. The gate shall be main. The gate shall be main. Let's pull the hex and wraiths over. The Shabbaty don't have magical attacks, do they? Nope. The gate is about to fall and be main. Archers, come on over. I'm going to stick you on the walls up here. But I'm going to wait until I own all this. Because then they can just come in here and up. Like, come on, crumble already. You're getting attacked by here, there and everywhere. And you're just archers. Come on. Archers are holding out quite well. Even with so much stuff attacking them. Right, come on, they've got next to no one in the gate. I should be taking it over by now. Why are they not crumbling? It's like we'll fight to the last. Come on now. Oh, well, if they're going to be in range, archers shoot the Ashabiti. Same with the chariot archers, shoot the Ashabiti. There we go. What the fudge? Oh, they do have it. They're dying fast though.
Damn them, they ruined my hex and reef plan. The gate is still theirs. How the hell is the gate theirs? Is it, oh, has it got to be a unit down there to take the gate? Fine then. Charge! Archers pull back. Chariot archers pull back. These are shabty, can barely even hurt hex and reefs. Uh, we'll summon my Shabti up their bum holes. Where are they going? Why are they not just coming right out? There we go, charge! Archers, I told you just to pull out. Oh yeah, my archers crumble instantly when they're in combat. Even against a unit that basically should be dead. How's that still got morale? Come on, they're about to crumble. Right, the gateway is mine. Charge on through. My hex and wraiths. It's not exactly the way I wanted it. But oh well, that's what we have to do. Right, there are Shabbat are about to crumble. I'm surprised they're not crumbling more than this. You can get in there now too. These will be as well charging as well, now I think about it. Come on, just crumble already! We've seen how well they defended it with just a few units. And I've got a lot more archers than they had. Oh no, although they had more archers than me. Oh well. Oh no, but I'll have the... No, I'll have everything they had, because I'll have the garrison as well. So imagine how well with an army I'll be able to defend this place. Come on, crumble already! The Hex and Wraiths are beautiful. They've got no magical damage, so they can barely hurt them. They're tanking most of the damage at the moment. Girls pull back, don't want to lose you. Come on, crumble and die! For Nehikara! For Nehikara! Your warriors are rallying. Come on, this battle should just be over now. Hey, they're gone. Good job, Hex and Wraiths. Just him now. Waiting on him to die. There we go. Settlement is mine. Rawr. We got the Sword of Bloodshed. Nice. Ranking up for him. Lovely. Take it all. Just occupy. Sword of Bloodshed. Oh, that's a nice weapon. Yeah, and, uh, don't need two public order buildings, so we'll build that there. My it's for you. Get me a root marcher. Trust it. What was your... King Lehmir, so the 4th dynasty. The Shabbaty melee attack, missile damage from Shabbaty. Great blows to Shabbaty. Oh. We need to get you some of Shabbaty. That's for now. Get yourself. A couple of units of carrion. And a unit of swordsman. Is that army that's mustered in there? Not your best. But I'll have a garrison of my own, which will provide a couple of units of archers. 
It's going to take them a couple of turns to get over here. That will replenish. This army will replenish. You'll have these new units. We should be able to hold. Be a pain if he decides to go straight after the Elven Ruins, so I don't know what I'm going to do if he does that. That is. That's going to be the problemio. And as for everywhere else, I think we're as happy as Larry. If Larry was very happy, that would be the case. So yes! I hope you've all enjoyed this. Join me all next time, where we're going to hopefully take out Camry. We really need to take Camry, because when I've got Camry, then these guys will stop constantly holding up these two armies, and then I'll be able to envelop these guys, and then I just need to swallow the people in the middle of me that I've had to sort of miss. See if these guys want to join me in the war, actually, because they quite like me, don't they? Well, they did like me. My sarcophagus is currently empty. Do you wish to fill it? Maybe I do. Moderate already. Hmm, so if I offer a small payment... High chance to accept. My will. There we go. Diplomacy in action. Join my war! So they've joined my war, so these guys are there now, so hopefully they'll juke it out! I know they're already at war with Camry, so that is really good. If they've got my tower though, I'm going to be taking it from them at some point, no matter what. I'm not going to ally with them. I don't think we can confederate. Submit to the gods of Nehekaradain that we speak. Nope. It's a fool that ignore. So yes, hope you've all enjoyed this. Join me all next time. I'll see you all there. Bye-bye.